There's the computer. We're back. I think I got the right driver now. Let me find out. I hope. I got a 32 bit this time, so. Well, the one I had on there was in my database. This one I had to download, so. This one took me about an hour and a half to download. <laughs> Cause my internet just ultimately sucks out here. And this computer's not hooked in. I found out this computer's only got a 40 gig hard drive and I'm probably gonna put a bigger hard drive in it, but Instead of having to do a reload and reinstall the software, I'm, I'm just going to clone the operating system from this one to the other drive. So. I got to find me a drive first. Yes, I accept the EULA. Why would I not accept the EULA? Then I would be doing this for nothing. Pretty much they should make it where you accept the EULA before you even buy the product. Like, if you buy the product, you take it to the register, they should say, oh, you gotta accept this EULA. It save you a trip from having to go back to the store saying, oh, I don't accept the license terms, but well, I mean, like, like, why would you do that? For example, I mean, it would be stupid just to buy software, take it home, install it, and then say, oh, I don't accept the end user license agreement, and I have to run all the way back to the store, and that's crazy. This is going to take forever and ever and ever and ever. Well, this computer's only got a gig of memory in it, which I got memory lying around here somewhere that I can throw in it. We're just trotting right along here. So. Well, we're moving right along now. We're almost about halfway done through the install process. So. I had to install the .NET framework and all that bull crap. All that crap. Uh, let's finish the installation, so... Just finished the installation. View the log. Don't ask me again. Don't ask me again. Everything was successful. So, no errors. 
finish. Yes, I want to restart the computer now. I'm gonna fix that PXE thing real quick. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Nah, it shouldn't pop up anymore. Unless the hard drive's dead in it. There we go. Faster boot process. That thing that kept popping up, that PXE shit that's for network booting. Typically used in a corporate environment, you don't network boot from your home. Oh, I can tell it looks better already. I wouldn't even loaded the desktop yet. I'm surprised my monitor ain't convulsing yet. At least the resolution is fixed now. Things running a little on the slow side. Bikes, it's only got a gig of memory in it. And look at that. So. Almost a year later, or maybe a little bit after that, I finally got this computer done. Because now it has. Um, A video card in it now. I wonder if that other one still shows up. Nope. 5570 is what this one was. A Radian HD 5570. I don't know if that's a good one or a bad one, but all I know is it supports the Aeroglass feature. Has to be a good one because it's got fucking HDMI on it, so. Um, but yeah. What I'm probably gonna do with this computer, since I've already loaded Windows 7 on it and I already installed all the software and I'm gonna put more, I'm gonna put some games on it and stuff. Um, I'm gonna put a bigger hard drive. In. It's only got a 40 gig in it. I think I got a two. I think I got a 320 gig sitting up there somewhere. But anyways, I'm going to do that. And I'm going to sell this. I'm going to ask 100 bucks for it. If not, I'll take 85 for it. So I'm also going to put a little more memory in it. But right now is going to be the end. of the Dell Optiplex GX280 second gen see the GX280 I used to have an Optiplex sitting down there if you touch it with blue screen so I ended up junking it out but this is a second generation version it's a BTX version so but, well, if once the world dries up outside, we'll be outside messing with vending machines. So, that's what I got in store for my next project series. But, fucking right. No? It's just wet. It's just very wet out there, so. 
Uh, I got that Mac sitting up there. I might grab it and fire it up, see what it does. So, I don't know. I'll see you on the next video, tutorial, or project. Cool.